D2L email will allow you to quickly and easily contact your instructor and your classmates. This video will provide an overview of the navigation of your D2L inbox, checking your email, responding to email, and composing a new email to classmates or instructors. Please note that it is recommended that you use D2L email as your primary form of communication regarding all class content matters. If your instructor has different preferences, please follow their instructions. When first logging into D2L, you will notice an envelope icon on your minibar. To access your D2L email, first click this icon. Then choose the Go to Email link. You will automatically be taken to your D2L email inbox. Your received messages will be listed in the middle of the page. An email subject that is bolded means that this email message has not yet been read. An email message that is not bolded means the message has been read. You will see the sender, the subject if the sender chose to include one, and the date and time the message was sent. To read an email message, simply click on the email you'd like to read. Notice that your email message appears below your inbox. You may need to adjust the screen size by moving the bar that separates the inbox from your message up or down. Inside your message, you will again see the sender and date and time along with their message. You can use the reply or reply all buttons to send a reply to the sender. To reply to an email message, simply click the reply or reply all button. A pop-up window will appear with the recipient's address and the subject already included. Type your reply in the body field. If you'd like to add attachments to your email message, click the Upload button to browse your computer. When you are finished with your message, click Send at the top of your window. To delete an email message, simply check the checkbox next to the email message you'd like to delete. Then, choose the Move to Trash link located above your inbox messages. Take note of the folders on the left side of the page. Here you can access your sent mail, drafts, trash, and address book. If you would like to use folders, you may also create your own folders. To create your own folder, first click the Folder Management button located next to the Compose button underneath the Inbox heading. Then click the New Folder button. Type the name of your new folder. Click Save. Click Inbox or Message List to return to your inbox messages. You can then move messages from your inbox to your preferred folders. To do this, click the checkbox next to the email message you'd like to move. Then choose the Move To drop-down menu and choose the folder you'd like your message to reside in. To send an email to your instructor or classmates, the easiest way is by using the Class List tool from your course. Begin on the course homepage with the instructor or classmate you would like to send an email to. Click the Other Tools drop-down menu from the nav bar and choose Class List. Locate the classmate or the instructor you'd like to send an email to. Click that recipient's name. A pop-up will appear for you to type your message in. Type a subject in in the subject field. Then type your message in the body field. You may add attachments by clicking the Upload button and browsing your computer for the document you'd like to send. Otherwise, when you are finished, scroll to the top and click the Send button. This has been an overview of the D2L email tool. For more information, please visit the Student Resources webpage. Thank you for watching.